What's up guys? This is Coach Donnie with ElevateYourself.org. In this video, we'll talk about outside hitter transition footwork, mainly from blocking to attacking or digging defense to attacking. Before you continue watching this video, there are three videos that you need to watch in order to effectively apply this transition footwork. The first video is spiking footwork. The second video is outside hitter blocking footwork. The third video is outside hitter defensive footwork. And you can watch all three of those videos by clicking on the link up here. Now we will talk about how to transition from blocking to attacking. Once you land on both feet after you block, open up toward the court by turning to your right and immediately take a step with your right foot in the direction that you want to start your spiking approach. Then cross step with your left foot to cover more distance and then hop into place by turning to your left and simultaneously switching your feet so that you can immediately land in a position where you can start your spiking approach. Next we'll talk about how to transition from an off blocker defender to attacking. Once you land into your off blocker defensive position, open up and turn in the direction that you feel the most comfortable with. I prefer to open up to my left, which means turning to my left and taking a step with your left foot toward where you want to start your spiking approach, then cross step with the right foot, then hop and turn simultaneously so that your feet land in a position to start your spiking approach. Let's talk about why open cross hop footwork is the most effective way to transition from defense to offense. Open cross hop requires fewer movements and allows you to move faster compared to running backwards or backpedaling. It's important to open up toward the court by turning to your right so you can see what is happening on the court and be ready to adjust your spiking approach based on the pass or you might have to set the second ball. 
If you turn to your left away from the court, you cannot see what is happening and it will require you to turn to a greater degree which will slow you down. Here are a few drills to help you practice your transition footwork as an outside hitter. The first drill will help you transition from blocking to spiking. Start in your left front blocking base position. Once the coach initiates the drill by slapping the ball, perform a block against the opponent's right side attacker. Once you land, execute your open cross hop footwork. The moment you are in position to start your spiking approach, the coach will toss a ball for you to spike. The second drill is to transition from digging to spiking. Start in the left front base position. Once the coach initiates the drill by slapping the ball, you will move into your defensive off blocker position. Once you land, the coach will slap the ball again to initiate the pass, and then you will execute your open cross hop footwork. Once you are in position to start your spiking approach, the coach will toss a ball for you to spike. Once you can perform the transition footwork drills with the coach tossing, you can have the coach hit at you or hit at a defender and then set for you and transition to make the drill more game-like. Lastly, I will go over a few more important considerations when applying the outside hitter transition footwork. You can also apply open cross hop footwork when you are spiking multiple times in a rally or get set two times in a row. If you are a shorter player or have to travel a further distance based on where you play defense, you can take multiple cross steps, which is essentially running, before you hop into your spiking approach position. Your ultimate goal is to be loaded and ready to spike before the setter touches the ball. It's easy to be stuck standing still and watching the game instead of transitioning to be one step ahead of the ball. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, make sure that you like this video and share it with all of your volleyball friends and teammates who would like to learn outside hitter transition footwork.
Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel where I'll be releasing weekly volleyball tutorial videos just like this one. If you have any other video suggestions regarding volleyball, athletic training, or fitness, make sure that you look through my YouTube channel before providing a video suggestion. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.